This information was made available by Akpo Oyagua Refrigeration Company. What is a cold room? A cold room is a refrigerated space used to store perishable goods at low temperatures. They are typically used in commercial and industrial settings, such as supermarkets, warehouses, and laboratories. The temperature inside a cold room can be adjusted as needed to preserve the goods stored inside, and the room is typically insulated to maintain the desired temperature. What items can be stored in a cold room? A cold room can be used to store a wide variety of perishable goods that need to be kept at a low temperature in order to maintain their quality and safety. Some common items that are stored in cold rooms include food items such as meat, dairy products, seafood, fruits, and vegetables, medical and laboratory samples, such as biological specimens and vaccines, flowers and plants, chemicals that need to be stored at low temperatures, pharmaceutical products, such as medicines and vaccines, certain industrial products, such as certain types of plastics and other materials that can be damaged by heat. The specific items that can be stored in a cold room will depend on the particular requirements of those goods. For example, different types of food require different storage temperatures to maintain their quality. How does a cold room work? A cold room works by maintaining a low temperature inside the room to preserve the perishable goods stored inside. The basic components of a cold room include insulation, a refrigeration system, and temperature control equipment. 1. Insulation. The walls, floor, and ceiling of a cold room are typically insulated to keep the cold inside the room and to prevent heat from outside from entering the room. This can be done using materials such as polyurethane foam, which has a high insulation value. 2. Refrigeration system. A refrigeration system is used to cool the air inside the cold room. The most common types of refrigeration systems used in cold rooms are vapor compression refrigeration systems, which use a compressor, condenser, evaporator and a refrigerant such as R134A to transfer heat from the inside of the cold room to the outside. 3. Temperature control equipment. A thermostat or temperature control system is used to monitor and maintain the temperature inside the cold room. This equipment can be programmed to turn the refrigeration system on and off as needed to maintain the desired temperature. The cold room keeps certain temperature range as per requirement of items stored in it. Additionally, humidity control can also be added to the cold room, if humidity is also a key factor for preservation of stored goods. Types of cold rooms There are several different types of cold rooms, which are designed for specific uses and can vary in terms of size, temperature range, and features. Some common types of cold rooms include 1. Walk-in cold room. A walk-in cold room is a large refrigerated space that can be entered by people. Typically it has a door for access. These rooms are used in commercial and industrial settings, such as supermarkets, warehouses, and food processing plants. 2. Blast freezer. A blast freezer is a cold room designed to rapidly freeze food products. The temperature in a blast freezer is typically much colder than in a traditional cold room, around minus 40 degrees Celsius, and the freezing process happens quickly to preserve the food's quality and taste. 3. Controlled atmosphere room. Controlled atmosphere rooms are used to store fruits and vegetables. They are designed to maintain specific levels of oxygen, carbon dioxide and other gases to slow down the ripening process and preserve the quality of produce. 4. Blood bank refrigeration. Blood bank refrigeration are specialized cold rooms used to store blood and blood products, including plasma, red blood cells, and platelets. The temperature is maintained between 1 to 6 degrees Celsius. 5. Pharmacy refrigerator. Pharmacy refrigerator are specialized cold rooms used for storing pharmaceutical products. These are specially designed to prevent from temperature fluctuation, power failure and the room have alarm system to alert the concerned person in case of any power failure or temperature deviation. 6. Medical Laboratory Refrigeration Medical laboratory refrigeration are specialized cold rooms used for storing medical samples, cultures and reagents. These rooms have very specific temperature range for different types of samples, to maintain the integrity of samples. These are few examples, similar to that based on the requirement and size cold rooms can be designed, each with its own temperature range and features to accommodate different types of goods.
Akpo Oyagwa Refrigeration Company is the leading cold room manufacturer in Nigeria, offering diverse range of cold rooms, blast freezers and walk-in freezers for commercial use. What is the temperature range of a cold room? The temperature range of a cold room, also known as a refrigerated room or walk-in cooler, is typically between 1 degree Celsius and 4 degrees Celsius. This range is used for storing perishable food items such as meats, dairy, and produce. The temperature may vary slightly depending on the specific use of the cold room and the type of products being stored. What is a blast freezer? A blast freezer is a type of freezer that is designed to quickly freeze large quantities of food products to a very low temperature minus 40 degrees Celsius or lower in a relatively short period of time. The purpose of this is to lock in the freshness, flavor, and nutritional value of the food, as well as to halt bacterial growth. The rapid freezing also helps to preserve the structural integrity of the food, so it maintains its shape and texture during thawing and cooking. Blast freezers are commonly used in commercial food processing and catering operations, as well as in some households. The process is called as quick freezing. What items can be stored in a blast freezer? A wide variety of items can be stored in a blast freezer, including meat and poultry. These items can be frozen quickly to lock in freshness and flavor. Seafood. Fish and shellfish can be frozen quickly to maintain their texture and quality. Prepared meals and entrees. These items can be frozen in bulk and then thawed and heated as needed. Desserts and baked goods. These items can be frozen quickly to preserve their texture and flavor. Ice cream and frozen desserts. These items can be frozen quickly to maintain their texture and consistency. Beverages. Certain drinks like juices, smoothies, and alcoholic beverages can be stored in a blast freezer. It's worth noting that different items have different optimal freezing conditions and temperatures, so it's important to consult a food specialist or consult guidelines to ensure that food stored in a blast freezer is being stored safely. How does a blast freezer work? A blast freezer works by rapidly lowering the temperature of the food products that are placed inside of it. The basic principle of operation is the removal of heat from the food by circulating cold air around the products. This circulation is usually done by fans. The air inside a blast freezer is usually kept at a temperature between minus 40 degrees Celsius and minus 51 degrees Celsius which is much colder than a regular freezer. This extreme cold temperature causes the water inside the food to freeze quickly, which in turn slows down or stops the activity of bacteria and enzymes that can cause food to spoil. A refrigeration system is used to cool the air inside the blast freezer. This system is typically made up of a compressor, an evaporator, and a condenser. The compressor compresses the refrigerant and forces it through the condenser, where it releases its heat and turns into a liquid. The liquid refrigerant then flows into the evaporator, where it evaporates and cools the air that is blown into the blast freezer. Some advanced blast freezers also include features like humidity control and temperature mapping to ensure the safety and quality of the frozen products. These features are more commonly used in food industry. Another way to accomplish quick freezing is with the use of liquid nitrogen. Food is submerged into a liquid nitrogen bath, that way the food is cooled down extremely quickly. This process is called as cryogenic freezing. What is the temperature range of a blast freezer? The temperature range of a blast freezer is typically between minus 40 degrees Celsius and minus 51 degrees Celsius. This range is the industry standard and most common temperature range used for blast freezers. This extreme cold temperature is used to quickly freeze large quantities of food products and to lock in their freshness, flavor, and nutritional value, as well as to halt bacterial growth. The rapid freezing also helps to preserve the structural integrity of the food, so it maintains its shape and texture during thawing and cooking. However, it's worth noting that different items have different optimal freezing conditions and temperatures. For example, some delicate fruits and vegetables may require a slower freezing process at a higher temperature to prevent damage, while some items that are already frozen need to be stored at a temperature closer to minus 51 degrees Celsius to maintain their quality during storage. So, it's important to consult a food specialist or guidelines to ensure that the food stored in a blast freezer is being stored safely. Akpo Oyagwa Refrigeration Company is your reliable source for cold room, blast freezer and walk-in freezer construction.